Good Friday afternoon. This is Micah Mitchell with Madison County Weather Updates, bringing you the True View Exterior Severe Outlook uh, for today, and then we're going to take a look at Sunday as well. Here's a look at uh, Radar Omega. We're taking a look at a line of storms that's really putting itself together. Uh, there was actually a part of this line earlier this morning that formed a derecho that didn't just didn't last very long but uh, now it's trying to form itself into more of a line we can see that most of the cells are moving to the northeast but the overall line itself is uh, going to be slowly moving you know kind of this whole whole line here if I can use my pen right this whole line will slowly progress to the east as we get uh, late afternoon into the evening. I believe Madison County is probably going to be impacted in the evening hours. There could be some strong to severe thunderstorms and uh, with damaging winds as the main risk. Uh, there were a couple of tornado warnings out in Illinois earlier, but uh, for Madison County it looks like potentially a damaging wind, maybe a hail threat, but uh, overall there's uh, no real tornado threat for us the way it looks right now. Here's a look at the Storm Prediction Center outlook for today. And uh, as we zoom in, Madison County, you know, Indianapolis, you know, we're in a uh, slight risk for severe as you get east toward Muncie and Newcastle. It's a marginal risk, and that has to do with timing more than anything. But I think the entire state needs to be aware that severe is possible. Again, the uh, main threats uh, highlighted, you can see the tornado threat is back over Illinois. Uh, for Madison County, the main threats are going to be, I don't know why, this thing has been resetting itself so much lately. At any rate, uh, damaging winds are the main threat to us here in Madison County. Maybe some uh, large hail, but primarily damaging winds, and to me, mostly from decaying storms. I think microbursts could be uh, a possibility today. Uh, tomorrow there's a little bit of a rain chance, but that's primarily going to be in the early hours and the pre-dawn hours as the system gets itself out of here. Most of tomorrow should be in good shape. And then we attention turns to Sunday. And Sunday we are in a, Madison County is kind of on the borderline between um, an enhanced and a slight risk for severe. It's kind of got areas like Pendleton and enhanced. But again, the storms don't care where the line is, and I actually think this could be pulled farther to the northeast. And I, I wouldn't be surprised to see a moderate risk get added to southwestern Indiana and southern Illinois. Actually, as we get into tomorrow, we'll see how that plays out. But for now, we will be watching the severe threat on Sunday. Um, there's also a crosshatched area that comes up to the northeast of Indianapolis that uh, means that there's a greater than 10% risk of significant severe. So uh, again, I think that can be pulled to the northeast some. So we'll see how things look tomorrow. But uh, again, we're in a slight risk for severe this evening, damaging winds being the main threat. Sunday, primarily to me, Sunday afternoon, Sunday evening, we'll be watching for severe again, May probably more out widespread on Sunday. All modes of severe will be on the table on Sunday. And again, I would not be surprised to see some upgrades and see some of this pulled farther to the northeast by the Storm Prediction Center. And I would not be surprised to see southwestern Indiana and southern Illinois maybe even get put into a moderate risk for severe for Sunday. So I'll update you as things progress. If we have any severe that threatens the county this evening, I will update you. Uh, otherwise, um, you know, just stay weather aware, aware this evening. Uh, it may be my birthday, but I will keep you updated anyway. And I, again, it, with it being my birthday, if you don't normally donate to the page, it would be awesome if you took today and did so just to show some birthday love. But uh, if not, that's uh, okay too. So again, stay weather aware. I will update you if needed this evening, and we'll see how Sunday shapes up as well. This is Micah Mitchell with Madison County Weather Updates. Have a great evening and have a safe Memorial Day weekend.